You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Item provided by Nostalgia Products for review. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop, and today we are going to make hot dogs. Get We're your hot dogs, step right up, get your red hots. We now have a 50s style pop up hot dog toaster. A toaster? Yes. Really? I do want to say thanks to Nostalgia Products for sending us this toaster to check out on video. Yeah. And it's a special toaster because you put four hot dogs and four buns, put the lever down, and pop. All done. Cook. Where do you put the toast? No toast. English muffin? It is a hot dog bun toaster. Bagel. Perfectly delicious mm. hot dogs every time. Fits thicker, thicker hot dogs that plump. Really? Yep. They plump when you toast them. There you go. Mm -hmm. Now, there's not much on the box, but I will show you the side because it gives a little information on how to set this up. Place four hot dogs and four buns in the hot dog toaster. Check. Select how well the hot dogs will be cooked and press the lever down. Really? Enjoy perfect and delicious hot dogs every time. Mm-hmm. There is the other side of the box. Not much to it. Well, actually, yeah. Okay, so it's Wait a repeat. Wait a second. It's there all is repeat. one thing to it, LPS Dave. Yeah, what's that? What is that one in the middle back there? The middle What's back that there. that terrible ingredient that's on top of oh, it? Oh, the ketchup. Hot, well, uh, some people like ketchup mm. on their hot dogs. I know. Not a Chicago-style hot dog. Mm -mm. So that's what we're going to have to do. I know we have a video where you and I did a challenge. Did you say you're going to challenge me to a hot dog contest right now? Well, I never really bring it up because it's not really a challenge. If I had fingertips, I'd be air-quoting right now, LPS Dave. It's not a challenge. Mm, yeah, mm -hmm. I've heard uh, we still get comments on that video mm -hmm. that uh, that I win. I won. I out. don't know about that. Really? I'm keeping a running tally. So you think you're like the premier hot dog creator? I happen to be. I've been noticed, LPS Dave. Let's just say that. Noticed how? The editors of Bon Appetit magazine, maybe. Bon Appetit. Huh? You mean dog bone appetite. That's the one I've been seeing you read. Dog bone appetite, <laughs> yes. Uh, don't, don't misinform mm. everybody out mm. there. Not the official bone appetite. Well, you might be a little jealous of my hot dogging, that's all. Whatever. Mm -hmm. So I guess the official challenge is on. Interesting. It is a new year, LPS Dave. I've got some new ideas. Aha. Uh -huh. The ninja hot dog maker will not be defeated. All right. So mm -hmm. when we come back then, Butch and I will test this out and create some hot dogs. And, uh, of course, I'll have a link in the description to the original challenge mm -hmm. that I won. That I won. And then uh, thanks again to Nostalgia Products for sending this. We are now going to make hot dogs. Let's toast up some dogs, LPS Dave. All right, we are Wait back. Wait a second, LPS Dave. Yes, sir. Time out. Hold the hot dog bus. T for time out. That's right. Yes. The hot dogs are not going to fit through those little holes. No, the these are not Dave. tiny hot dogs. We wanted to show everybody the bottom to show them that the cord conveniently oh. wraps underneath. And we also found that this fits nice in here so you can wrap it all down and mm -hmm. then you are good to go. For right? when it's on display. Yes. Mm -hmm. And then uh, we come back now, uh, when we come back now, mm -hmm. we will show them the inside so we can get a good idea about how this thing works and what it looks like. We just showed them the outards. Now yeah. it's time to show them the innards. Yes, you are correct. Mm -hmm. We'll be right back. All right, Butch, check it out. It is the top-down view now. It's a beautiful thing, LPS Dave. It is. You're way up there. You're like up hanging from the ceiling. How about do you do that? About six feet from mm -hmm. the ceiling. Now, mm -hmm. I know you can't see inside. You're kind of just looking at the mm -hmm. lever that I'm raises imagining. the... This raises and lowers everything, mm -hmm. okay? And then the baskets just plop in. There's a little notch there, okay? And that just lines up with that pin. The hot Once dog notch. notch. Yes, the mm -hmm. hot dog notch. Now check this out. I know you can't see this, but everybody else can. Here is your cleaning tray. So these come out. You can clean them. This is metal. This is plastic, okay? It's like a post-meal snack, LPS Dave. You yeah. lick up the crumbs and lick up the hot dog drippings. I guess so. Mm, so we're delicious. one step closer now. We will come back now with our hot dogs and buns and... Uh, really? It's time? Give it a whirl. A wh Have you ever whirled hot dogs? I haven't, but see, check that out. So I think with the weight of the hot dogs, it'll help mm -hmm. those come down with it, but we'll see. Mm -hmm. Almost there, Butch. I know everybody's getting excited. I do Ooh. have my hot dogs and my buns ready off to the side, but we can't really finish the video till we show more of the machine, right? 
Well, boy, oh boy, this is like Christmas morning waiting to open presents, LPS Dave. It is, it is. I have the smell of hot dogs dancing in my nostrils, and it uh -huh. hasn't even started smell yet. Smell of hot dogs. Mm -hmm. All right, well, it is plugged in. It looks like we have a one, two, three, four, and five heat setting, hmm. a stop button in case you see something you want to stop it. That's good to know. And then the side, look at the styling of the side. Check that out. It says retro series. Mm -hmm. And that cool diners, Cadillac kind of 50s style there. Yeah. And is this then, how they cook hot dogs in the 50s in the diners? I don't think so. Mm. I don't think they were this advanced then. They mm -hmm. would probably just, uh, you know, throw them on a griddle or, you know, whatever. Who knows? Interesting. No it's so prehistoric. Either. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Read this before use. This unit has a heating element, and during the first use, it may appear to smoke for a short period of time. Mm. This will stop and does not indicate a defect or hazard. Defect? But it, defect. But it will add to the flavor. It, it should add to the flavor. It says remove this label. Okay. That's smoky. Let's get that out of here. Come on. Come on. Oh, Ooh. yeah. Heat. Heat. All right, so let me get my dogs out of the package. Here we go. I am using Oscar Mayer Classic Wieners. Mm -hmm. Only the best. I like Oscar Mayer. Mm-hmm. If I were an Oscar Mayer wiener, maybe you could put that in the comments. If I were an Oscar Mayer wiener, <laughs> everyone would cook me in a toaster. Yes. Mm -hmm. All right, so let me get some buns. Now, did it say to kind of open the buns a little? You must have to open them to get them in there. So you probably, let's see, always make sure that the cord is away, okay, from water source. That's good. It says to shorten the cookie time, simply turn the heat control knob to a lighter setting or all the way to heat setting one, low. Mm -hmm. Okay. To stop cooking before cycle is completed, press the stop button. After the unit is cool to the touch, remove the hot dog basket and crumb catcher and follow directions in cleaning and maintenance. Okay. Check. Check, 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 check. So let's just see how to get these in here. So you kind of probably got to open them up just slightly, right? Mm -hmm. To make them fit that, you gotta follow the rounded that void. edge there. There you go. Oh, this is gonna be good. Yeah, I can't wait. It's our lunch today here. Let mm -hmm. me put this one back here. This way we can see the hot dogs going in. Let's get those in now. Mm -hmm. Do you want to make two or do you want to make four to start just for testing? I this think we start with four. Start with four, and then go on multiples of four after that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Eight, eleven. You said it. Mm-hmm. We gotta balance the machine out, LPS Dave. Okay. I don't think they require you to make four, but we mm. will uh, follow Butch's My lead on this. My stomach requires us to okay. make four. I can't tell if they're all the way down or not. I think they are. Mm -hmm. All right, we will come back now, double check everything, and I think I want to do a top-down cooking on this, Butch. I want to kind of right. get the camera straight down so we can maybe catch any sizzling or smoke. We'll be right back. Top-down, bottom-up, doesn't matter as long as we're seeing cooking. And we're eating them. Mm-hmm. All right, here we go. They are set. Locked I, and loaded up. I have them yeah. set to a three, so we'll see what uh -huh, we get out of uh -huh, a three. Uh -huh. Medium. Here we go. A medium, yeah. I will push it down now. Ooh, looks mm -hmm. like a couple buns need to be... We went with the large buns. Tucked in. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we will just see what happens. Is it done? Is it done? It is, is it done? not is it done, done. Is it done? Is it done? Inside. Here, let me turn it this way. Now you get that nice look inside. We'll see. Mm -hmm. The heat element, maybe? Is it done? Is it done? Is it done? Is it done? It is close mm -hmm. to being done, yes. I mean, you could eat your hot dogs just like that if you wanted to. Really? Hmm. All right, so we will let these cook now. I don't know how long a setting of three is, but we want some smoke. We're going to check the smoke detector, and mm -hmm. we'll see what happens. We'll just let it run. Maybe put on some music, some hot dog music. Fun. <laughs> Let me lift it up. Look at that. We've okay, got so, some brownage yes, on the bun. It's toasted on the buns. Mm -hmm. They feel soft and warm. Let me grab my little... Wiener grabbers. <laughs> I wasn't going to say it, but I'll mm -hmm. let you say it. All right, so I would say I would go full five next time, huh? mm -hmm. don't you think? Mm -hmm. let, me just, let me just feel this here. Yeah, it's hot. All right, so mm. we will uh, test these out, maybe make a few more, and then uh, we'll come back and then... Build our hot dogs. Yeah. Test them out by eating them. Well, of course. But we'll do that when we come back. Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. Mm. Let me grab your bun. Let's see. Easy. 
toasty mm -hmm. on the edges. Mm -hmm. There's mine. Oh, mine's split. Let me grab another one here. Now, you might have to just push them down a little to get them to fit in there. All right. Mm -hmm. Let me grab your hot dog. Thank you, sir. Oh, yeah, I can Careful. probably pull the whole tray out, but let me just do it this way. Okay, there you go. Oh, beautiful. Lovely. I love right. toasted buns, LPS Dave. You love toasted buns. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm going to start with my standard here just because I like, you know, normal. Normal, boring. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Normal, boring. Yeah, mm -hmm. I guess you can say that. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to take a little bit of onion and ch chop it up and have it ready. This is exciting. Hmm. So every year you come up with a new hot dog topping. It's cutting edge, LPS Dave. It's cutting. what's on the cutting edge of culinary arts. Okay. Mm -hmm. Whatever that means. I read I that. I have no idea. Mm -hmm. In dog bon appetit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I was watching the dog food channel. Uh, is there such a thing as the dog well, food channel? on dog cable. Dog cable. Mm -hmm. All right, You're paying see. for it, you know, so... The <laughs> mustard's ready. The that. top is off. I'm gonna, mm -hmm. I like mustard, okay? Careful. Oh, did you see that? Mm -mm. This has got one of those leak-proof like lids. It's a leak-proof lid. It won't leak. It's got this little... Oh, boy. Gasket oh boy. in there kind of thing. Yeah, I like mustard. Oh, that's a lot, LPS No, Dave. it's not. It's good. Mm. Everybody's going to like mine because mine is pretty much normal. Boring. Mm -hmm. Now, this is the Chicago-style relish, which they add a lot of green food coloring. It's fluorescent gray, LPS yeah, Dave. fluorescent gray. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Lots of relish. Oh, that's nice. I don't know if that bun's going to be able to hold that. Well, we're going to make it work. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to take a kosher dill pickle. Mm -hmm. A spear, if you will. <laughs> I'm just going to set that right in there. A little bigger than I normally use, but I think everybody gets the idea. Mm -hmm. And then you take a couple of these hot sport peppers. All right, sport peppers. Woo, that was hard to open, huh? Ouchie, wah wah. All right, so there is mine. Mm -hmm. Now, I like just a little... Just two, huh? Well, yeah. I like a little celery salt, too. That's one of my mm -hmm. favorite for a hot dog. Hmm. And then we'll put some onions. No tomato today. I uh, sometimes put tomato as well. I was going to say, that's just one slight difference, LPS Dave. As you'll notice when you go back and watch the video from last time, yeah, mm -hmm. this is very similar. Not much change. Because that's I don't much... change my favorite hot dog, uh -huh, okay? Uh -huh. and I, not this yearly thing. All right, uh -huh. yours is ready. All right, so. I'm coming. Ready? Oh, yeah, I'm ready. Right. I'm ready to go. This is 2017 Butch's favorite hot dog. Dun, 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 hmm. uh, Jiffy Crunchy Peanut Butter. Oh, okay. boy, LPS Dave. Do you want me to put that on the hot dog, or what's the, what's the system? I think you need to kind of ladle it on there, LPS Dave. Ladle it? Ladle away. Okay. I'll get the other part of that. Do you mind if I touch your hot dog here and move it off to the side? Please do. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's that? While you're doing that, marmalade. that's the other part of the peanut butter and jelly hot dog. Uh, with plum, plum, okay. Mm -hmm. Only right. the best. Oh, look Handmade. At, look at how crunchy France. that is, too. Where'd my hot dog go? I put it off to the oh, side, okay. remember? All right, so you got your peanut butter. It's a nice binder. A nice binder. Mm -hmm. You know, they put peanut butter on everything these days, LPS Dave. Do they? Who's they? Can you tell me who they is so I can uh, have, a, crazy have a conference with they? Peanut butter lovers. Peanut butter lovers. Mm -hmm. All right, mm -hmm. a little schmear of jelly on there. Peanut butter and jelly hot. A little dog. schmear, okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's lovely. Mm. That's lovely. It's actually looking pretty good. I've transitioned from the sardine pasta o's. Okay. All right, I'll be right back. All right, can I? I I'm gonna put the, the mm -hmm. hot dog back on this masterful creation. Now this right here, LPS Dave, mm -hmm. is where it takes a turn for the better. Okay. The you know what we need? What, what do Umami. we need? Umami. Umami. Mm. Right there. We need a little umami taste, LPS Dave. We're trying to get the entire palate. Right now, I like to call my mommy and say, uh, uh -huh. who raised mommy. this Who raised this I dog? I that's what it means. Mushrooms. Mm. Mm -hmm. That looks super tasty. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. make sure you get a little juice on there, too. I don't know about that. A uh, mm -hmm. little hard to work with, but... Maybe uh, you can pour that off. We can have a little sip uh, afterwards. Okay, a little sip of mushroom juice. Mm -hmm. All right, mushroom. Mm. That looks umami. Good. Yeah, whatever you're, whatever you're saying there. Umami. All, All right. right, LPS Dave. Now, mm -hmm. here... Mm -hmm. This right here is the big twist for 2017. Okay. What I like to do when I go to the grocery stores, mm -hmm. I like to look for cans that are missing their labels. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this right here is the surprise twist. You never know what you're going to get, but it always works. It looks like mushrooms again. Mm. I don't know. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, I hope not. And maybe it is. I wonder. Oh, you should have seen what I got last time. I don't know. I, I don't even chestnuts. know what it was. I can't explain it. Let's see. Uh -huh. um, it is black yes! olives. Mm. Oh, that's a good one. Interesting combination. Mm -hmm. Black olives. Oh, that goes so well with peanut butter. Okay, and jelly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Mm, that looks really good. A little, little salt on there. A little mm -hmm. acid. All right, is that good? Mm -hmm. Is that it? That's it, right? That's one, all? One more. One more mm -hmm. item. Mm -hmm. <sighs> In comes the topper. Maraschino cherry. Uh-huh. Okay, I thought we had the topper. Just like you sprinkle some onions on top of yours, LPS Dave. I like to end it with a flare. Do you want me to dice them up or just... Oh, no, no. Straight up. Two or three or... Sure. Okay. Just want to make sure you get one in every bite. Okay. I know you're going to be having more than one bite, so... All right. Uh-huh. Okay. Hmm. All right, well, I think I need to clean up a little bit mm. here, and then... Uh, oh, you got to eat it while it's still warm. The peanut butter is We will. We'll just push these in, move this out of the way, and then we will... Uh, I will taste yours. All right, here we go, Butch. Boy, uh, are you in for a treat, LPS Dave. I'm not too keen on that. Nothing says 2017 like this beautiful creation right here. It pretty much defines the year. Now, I decided to, well, I'm just going to ignore all that because mm -hmm. it's not defining anything for me except mm. for maybe an upset stomach. But here mm -hmm. we go. I decided to take the buns out. Remember the buns we had in there? I'm reheating the two hot dogs that were left because I think I want one to kind of clean my palate. Cleanse the palate. That's I might just want to eat one and show everybody... But let's wait for that to pop. Hey, you know, I was thinking maybe yeah, next boy. year I'll put Tums right on the hot dog. Then you eat it right with it. <laughs> Can it you make yeah, it? Maybe pit. grind them up into mm -hmm, a powder and then mm -hmm. mix it into peanut butter? Mm, interesting. Unless next year you're not going to have an actual peanut butter. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. Oh, there won't be peanut butter. Here, I'll stop. <laughs> nice. All right. So now we have a hot, Careful. hot dog. Ooh, it's hot. All right. So that is one that's just come out. Just a plain chaser. You know what? Let me compare it to one that's uncooked so we can see the difference if there's a color difference there mm -hmm. sure is mm -hmm. and a size difference and shrinkage and plumpage. Ooh, and heatness mm -hmm. okay all right so you take yours mm -hmm. and then i will take this one here and i am mm -hmm. ready to go i will take a bite of this masterful creation and oh, enjoy that lps oh, i can't wait actually this is looking really good better than the one with the sardines that's for mm -hmm. sure Ooh, look at that mm. all right here we go i'm going to now take a bite Here's what I'm getting. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The mushrooms don't come through at all. Right. Umami. Let me take one more bite. Mm, see, I knew it. Put a couple mushrooms in there. Mm -hmm. Let me try one more time. Mm hmm. Mmm! It's the peanut butter, isn't it, LPS Dave? Yeah, that's the high taste. Mm-hmm! It's delicious! Mm -hmm. I can't even taste the... What happened? What? My cheating! I ate a little nibble of the bun. I'm saving my appetite for my own creation, LPS Dave! You don't want to eat it? I don't want this. This is like 2001. Mmm. Alright, mm -hmm. well... I'll give it a taste. I was so looking forward you sure to this you don't anyway. Want to finish mine off here? Uh, you know, it's well There's here. Two cherries I'll tell you what. Yeah, let me have a cherry. There's three. There's one sitting in there. Mm -hmm. mm. I get the whole concept now. Mm-hmm. Mm. It's sweet and savory. It's salty and umami. So it works pretty good, huh? Which one do you like better? Honestly, honestly, if you were thinking as a man of 2017, yeah, what works better? I think, uh, grabbing a napkin here, mm -hmm. um, I think mine is the best. What? We'll let everybody Aww. decide out there, but I will say, it's a pretty unique hot dog. Mm-hmm. I'm thinking about LPS Dave, I'm thinking about opening up a hot dog stand in 2017. I think you should. What would you call it? Butch's Unique Wiener Creations. I like that. Mm-hmm. All right, well, thanks again to Nostalgia Products for sending us this retro series hot dog maker. A couple things. Mm hmm you might have to squish your buns down a little bit. Oh, always no one to squish, squish your, your buns. buns mm -hmm. <laughs> to get them to go down. But mm -hmm. uh, other than that, I think uh, it does cook them, and it worked pretty good. Delicious. And I'll put a link to the first challenge where yes. I won. Where I won. And then uh, we will uh, see you in the next video. And thanks for watching, everybody. Hey, there's one more dog left. Can I have that? Mm, just the plain one? Oh, no. 
I'm starting to think about 2018 already, LPS Dave. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Later. Bye-bye, everybody. Oh, yeah. Lucky me. Cleanup time. Hot dog bun crumbs and hot dog drippings. Mm. All right. I was uh, actually putting this away a day or two later and thought, hmm, maybe I'll add a little bit more to this video because I want to see the different heat settings. So I'm going to cook it on a one, two, three, four, and five. Five hot dogs, and then we'll see what they all look like after each cooking. So here is number one at heat setting one. I will come back then after it pops, set it on the plate, and then do one at two and work all the way to five. So I will be back. Okay, that was a one popping. Let's just see. And then what I'll do is I'll compare it to a uncooked one at the end. So let me cook a two now. I'll be right back. All right, the two is in there. This one was about 81 degrees. So we'll see what number two is. When that one pops, I'll take it out and put number three in. Okay, there is the next one. Now to be fair, I've been kind of letting it rest between each one. So that's why I'm stopping. But now look at the bun. It started to toast on the edge on that one. Let's get this in here. Then I need to let this rest. But let's get a quick temp on hot dog number two. Now that's showing 100, so it was 81, 104. And then I'll come back now after it rests a little bit and do hot dog number three. All right, heat setting number three. So when that one pops, I will come back and we will uh, take it out and move on to number four. All right, that was the third one popping. Let me get the bun out. Not as crusty as number two. Hmm, let's see what the temperature is on this one. I'll reset those in a second. We just want to see kind of where we're at. So 151. All right, let me let this cool down a little bit and put in number four. All right, that's number four. The bun is substantially crispier and smoking and then I actually heard some more sound on this one than the other ones and it's shrunk down so it's smaller let's get the temp on that definitely looks like it's okay 152 ooh a couple hot spots there so in that range about let's just say 150 because it went higher and then lower all right, the last one. The last one I think I'm going to watch uh, on camera because I heard sizzling and I heard some charring. Oh, look, there's a char spot. So let's just record the last one. Let me let it settle down a little, uh, settle down a little bit. Okay, set for about five to ten minutes just to let it cool down a little bit. And now I am going to do number five. So let's see. I'll just re record this. Okay, last one. As you can tell now, the bun is cooked the most, closer to the four. Let's check out this hot dog. I heard a lot of sizzling. I added some of that out, but so not, no burn spots, but let's check the temp real quick here. I can do it from this corner. About 173, 170. So in the 170 range. All right, let me come back now, move this out of the way, and then take a closer look. All right, and as a reference, uncooked. So let me just show you then. One minute, very close to that. I mean, heat setting one, heat setting two, heat setting three. They are getting smaller. Heat setting four, and heat setting five. So that's what we get. So I'll put all the temperatures and times in the description area. And then I am going to, now that I've handled all of these, go ahead and enjoy another hot dog. So I hope that helped out in some way. And thanks again for watching. Later. If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. 
What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up.